In this episode, I talk to you about my backpack I'm using for travel photography. Adorama TV presents Exploring Photography with Mark Wallace, where you will learn innovative techniques on shooting a wide range of photography. Here's your host. Hi everybody, you're watching another episode of Exploring Photography right here on Adorama TV. I'm Mark Wallace and as you've noticed, I'm on the beach here in the beautiful city of NASA in the Bahamas and I'm starting a, uh, a few years of travel around the world with my good friend Lex. And uh, a lot of people have seen the past episodes where I've talked about pre-production and all the stuff that we're doing to be get prepared, but now we're actually on the road. And uh, the question I've gotten more than anything is, what gear did you actually bring and how did you carry it? Well, here's the bag that I took right here. I'm gonna show you everything there is to know about this bag and what I put inside and how we're using it. So instead of doing this on the beach where it's really windy, we're gonna go to the courtyard outside of our little apartment that we rented and I'll show you everything there is to know about this bag. But before that, Check out these contests from Adorama. All right, well, let's take a look at this backpack. It's made by Tenba, and this is a brand new backpack. It's called the Shootout 24L. And there's some things about this that make it perfect for travel photography. Mainly, it's made to be really lightweight and rugged. Now, on the front here, you can see that this has got a suspension system for a tripod. So I'm going to take my tripod off really quickly. And you can see this actually uh, folds away. This is a uh, carbon fiber Benro Travel Angel tripod. We're going to put that to the side. Now, a couple of things I love about this on the outside one, on the side right here, if you want to get to your camera quickly, this just opens up and your camera can just be uh, pulled right out and you put that right in. So uh, that makes it easy to get access to a camera without having to open your entire bag. And then also there are a lot of considerations for travelers or those that shoot in the wilderness and that are these big uh, pockets to the side here so you can put a water bottle or whatever you want in the side and then there are big side pouches that you can put straps or monopods or whatever you want there's just a lot of things going on on this camera bag I've got all my little accessories in here I've got an iPhone inside and so it makes it really easy to get to things like travel documents right here I've got my all my documents and tickets and passport in there um, and then to the side here I've got my headphones that I can use if I need to so a lot of external pockets um, that allow you to do um, lots of things. And you also have uh, compression straps, so that's awesome. Well, what we want to do next is actually open up this bag. I'll show you what's inside, and we'll use the tripod to steady this uh, shot so we're not shooting handheld. So we'll do that right now. Inside this bag, you can see there's a ton of space. There are a couple of things that are missing right here. Right here is where we actually hold the video camera that's shooting the video that you're seeing right now. And then right here is where we hold the wireless microphones that I'm using right now. So that's why those two spots are empty. You can see this has a lot of room. This can hold a, uh, a professional DSLR body. This is a 70, uh, 24 to 70 millimeter lens. You could actually fit a 24 to 70 in here. So it's got a lot of space. And you can put your camera this way or this way. And you can actually hold two cameras. I've got mine in here because it goes out that side pocket right there. I also have another lens right here. This is 16 to 35. I've got some adapters for charging my USB devices. I've got my lens hood for my 65 uh, to 35, 16 to 35. And I also have my power adapter for my laptop that's in here. I also have uh, chargers for my uh, camera, for my video camera. I've got my zoom that we talked about in a couple episodes ago, my hard drive, my GoPro for shooting underwater video, things like that. I have a uh, a nice Leatherman here for adjusting tripods and anything that I would have to have. And then over here are all of my uh, cables for hooking up microphones, USB cables, um, windscreens, things like that. So lots and lots of space inside of this. I want to show you one more thing and that's how this use, is used as a uh, an actual laptop bag because I also have a computer in here. So I'm going to show you that next. Toward the back of the bag, there's a large compartment that holds a laptop. This is a 13-inch MacBook Pro. You can put up to a 15-inch laptop here. There's lots of padding to protect your gear, and so it's awesome. This is the Tenba Shootout 24L, and it's made specifically for adventure travel photography and those of you who are out shooting in the wilderness doing wildlife uh, photography. And you know, it's nice. It's, it can actually work for uh, corporate events or shooting at a wedding because it's nice and low-key. It's really an awesome bag. Now, all the gear and things that we talk talked about in this. I actually did some episodes previous to this episode that tells you why I'm taking that gear. So you might want to check that out right here on Adorama TV. Now, don't forget, all of that stuff is at the Adorama Learning Center. It has links for every single piece of equipment that was shown in this video. And you can subscribe to Adorama TV absolutely free. So here's a button. If you're watching on YouTube, click that button and subscribe right now. Why not? It is totally free. And I'll see you again next time.
Do you want great looking prints at low cost? Be sure to visit our easy to use online printing service. Adorama Pix has professionals who treat your images with the utmost care that you can count on. For a quick turnaround on photos, cards, or albums, use adoramapix.com.